Hello ladies and gentlemen, Bear here. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Minikaze, the Japanese destroyer. And uh, this guy is a little different than the Mahan, uh, has better concealment, but uh, less torpedoes than uh, the Mahan. Uh, we can fire six torpedoes from three two torpedo tubes as you can see uh, in the front here see my mouse? yeah in the front here um, and also have these two back here they can be shot from either side it doesn't really matter and the guns on this thing are pretty much terrible so without further ado let's go uh, check this guy out all right, so here we are on oceans. This map is favorable to Japanese destroyers. Uh, you're shit out of luck if you're on if you're an American destroyer like this Nicholas. Mainly because there's, as you can see, nothing to hide behind. So you pretty much end up getting wrecked very easily uh, because you get spotted super. Like, you get sp just to attack, you, you end up getting spotted. So, it makes it really difficult. Uh, because, like I said, you can't hide behind anything, so you're going to get shot up by the enemy uh, super easily. But, I don't have to worry about that. We are in the Minikaze. All we're going to do is use the old stay behind stealth, or stay in stealth and then shoot people the only problems are probably the Grimyashi and the Izokaze because they could they could get pretty close um, and figure out and well basically get me spotted which is not something we want So I'm going to start by just hanging back a little. Got this thing coming along. Let's go shoot some of this stuff down here. Far enough away that I shouldn't be, I shouldn't have any problems. Keep shooting! Can it destroy any of them? Oh, you're no fun. Oh, we got more coming. Perfect. One of this one. We got enemies coming from this side here. And I'm lagging. These guys. Destroyed. I won't be able to shoot this guy. It's easy, fuzzy. Line fire, maybe I'll get lucky. And the 
have another enemy DD over there. Those are back. Let's go take a peek over here. Concentrate fire on the enemy warship. See my victim. Oh, I see a uh, juicier victim here. Firing position. It's turning, which is no good. Need him to stop turning. This fire for spread and move away. This guy's gonna hopefully get destroyed. Come on, guys, get him. Perfect, so I won't be spotted. I'll just hang out for 22 seconds. After this guy, while staying away from the Omaha. Now if you paid attention to how I was spreading out those torpedoes, uh, you'll notice I'm doing half front, or directly on, half front, half back. And what that does is, uh, generally when they're going in the same direction as you, you can half front or more, because they will be turning away but still going forward. Um, and I like just shooting uh, one behind just in case they slow down. Try to avoid the torpedoes. This guy didn't, and he got wrecked for it. So now we're gonna go find another easy prey, which I think is gonna be this guy. Well, uh, this guy's coming up pretty quick. I might have to. move away a little. Attention, support 
Hello. Requesting fire support. This guy's turning. We're gonna wait till he's done his turn. Closer. Ah, looks like he's still turning. Oh, this guy. So if that guy keeps going straight, he'll be coming closer to my torpedoes, I believe. And we're gonna run away, because we don't want to be spotted, otherwise we'll get wrecked. So, I'll just wait this one out. Hi, Thunder. Received. I'm on it. Okay, so he turned all the way away. Which is good for me. I can move in a little closer to this guy. Out of here, get out of here, and I'm lagging. Fun stuff, eh? Come on, you can do it. Smoke screen set. There go, and he ate a bunch of those. Just good. targets. Um, I think we'll go after this guy. Actually, he's going to be a closer target. It's turning. Still turning. I want to keep my distance. That can scared a little by capturing. All stations, concentrate fire on the target. New cargo will be this guy, he's all by himself. <clears throat> Should be a little easier to get. That guy ate a torpedo, which is good for me. Oh. 
this guy's probably not going to slow down and he's just going to try to turn away. But hopefully he eats it. Oh, I did slow down. No, he did not. You see one hit. The enemy is about to win. But I sunk a bunch of these guys. Ah, uh, this is no bueno. Get out of here. These guys are going to be easy targets. This guy's only got 68. Here, scare the shit out of them. So that bought us some time, which is good. Oh, I got a DD on me. Oh no. Nope, Zilla. Engine boost activated. Ooh. Yes, eat them. Eat them all. No, just one. Oop. The only thing is that their dude, which is just over here, this guy, is going to get wrecked. I have no smoke left. I'm going to start dodging. I want to attack this guy. Sure, he goes down. If I can catch him on fire, he can't deploy his planes. There we go, now he's screwed. Straight here, and this guy will be our next target. Only problem being is that, yep, I'm detected.
unfortunately. Oh, no, we're not going to win this. And that is how you stay alive in a Minikaze. So, 2300 XP. That's a good haul. Uh, Confederate, which is very rare to get, or at least for me, it's very rare to get on a, on a destroyer. Uh, you basically have to do a lot of damage to a bunch of ships. And there's high caliber, which is the same thing, but it's less, uh, less damage. And I got two devastating strikes. Um, how do we do? So I'm in the top. With almost double my, double the Omaha score, which isn't too bad. We did uh, 155,000 damage in 17 hits, which is freaking awesome. But uh, anyways, I hope you guys like this video, and we will catch you on the flip side. Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this and would like to see more, leave me a thumbs up. And be sure to leave me a comment with suggestions of what you would like to see next. Until then, catch you on the flip side.